Hello and welcome to another video of this machine learning do-it-yourself video series. In this video, we're going to talk about random forestry. Random forest, it's a very interesting concept. Rather than relying on one single decision tree, it creates a set of trees, a collection of multiple trees, structures, to model and predict relationships among features and predict potential outcomes. So it does not depend upon one, so just one single tree. It creates multiple trees with different features to add diversity. And its important, important concept is it selects random features to create and add diversity to the trees. And at the end, it predicts the outcome based on multiple trees it has created and it takes a vote or it can do a response or a probability i'm going to talk to you in detail on that which can help drive better predictions this is the syntax so to create a model you would do random forest again this is a keyword and train predictors train target and this is the number of tree you want it to create. And this is predict. Again, predict is the keyword here, the model, the test data, and the type. This type decides whether it's going to be a response or a vote or a probability once those number of trees have been generated. So we are going to use the same balance scale data set which we used for tree C5.0. And you know about these attribute information. And you have pass, LBR, left weight, distance, right weight, and distance. And this is the citation for the data set. Using the same data set, which we implemented for C5.0, and potentially the same training and test data modules, we are going to create the random forest tree as well. So let's do random forest tree in the next video. Thank you for watching.